What do you think the biggest misconception is about the trades? Oh, there were dummies. As a kid, you know, you watch TV and stuff, and what do you remember? You remember the maintenance guy or the plumber with his butt hanging out of his pants and picking his nose, and he's obviously a moron or whatever. You know, this day and age, you can't be a dummy and be in the trades. I mean, there's so much high-efficiency stuff. There'll be a time here in the next 10 to 15 years if you have to have a, some understanding of low voltage and control training to be able to work on, like, water heaters. The job is changing. Cast iron and turn into PVC, and the old boys said, oh, those idiots, you know, blah, blah, blah. Well, you know, I was here during the copper to PEX transition. You know, if they don't make those transitions, we're not going to be able to keep up with the demand. We are getting some easier products. Things are quicker and faster, easier to install. We're also getting stuff that you can tell us what the problem is, much more efficient, better for the environment. It's going to require the technician to know what they're doing when they come and walk into these types of things. And the dummy, you know, that's the traditional thought of the plumber or whatever, that's, that's going to go away because you're going to have to know what you're doing. And we're going to charge more than doctors sometime soon because there's just not enough of us to do all the work.